is way nicer than the one at Endercon. Hey, Reuben, find any clues? Find anything interesting in that book? The only thing I've found so far is that the amulet was used to track the positions of the members of the Order. And does it mention how? It's less technical and, well, more historical. What you looking at? Nothing. Whatever. Axel? I was just trying to figure out where Petra might be. I mean, I know she's going to be fine, but I was just curious. We're going to find her. We're in the temple of the Order of the Stone. The Order's actual temple. Who'd have thought it, huh? A bunch of small towners like us wrapped up in an adventure like this. Yeah, it's pretty insane. I just... Hope we all come out the other side in one piece.
absolutely incredible! How did they build this? Okay, now I'm impressed. What do you think the colors mean? The different colors represent the different members. It's the order. It's showing where they are right now. Look, we don't know enough about how this thing works. Maybe the amulet only tracks them when they're on the surface. Or maybe it doesn't work when they're in the nether. We have to go off what we do know. There are only two lights on that map. If there are only two heroes left, we know what we need to do. Petra's relying on us. That wither storm is still out there. We know that Gabriel was trying to tell us something. We've got to find the Order of the Stone. But there are only two lights. There are only two members of the Order left? He said Soren was missing. That leaves Magnus. Or Eligard. Let's head out. I'm not going with you guys. I have to stay here. If I know Petra, she's probably doing everything she can to find this place. She's still out there. She has to be. We might need your help out there. You should come with us. No. You don't need me. This is where I should be. If there's even a small chance she's alive, I have to stay. Go. Get help. I'm gonna focus on making this place safe before nightfall. This temple is pretty big, though. If we're gonna have a chance of fortifying it, I'm gonna need some help. If, uh, maybe one of you guys can hang back with me? Sounds like Olivia will have you totally covered while me and Jesse are out finding Magnus. Finding Magnus? You really think that's how it's going to go? We need Eligard. She's the world's greatest engineer. She'll figure out a way to stop that thing. We're trying to destroy it. And when it comes to destruction, Magnus is the master. You're a smart person, Jesse. And obviously, the smart thing to do is to go get Magnus. I... <laughs> I think Axel meant Eligard there, Jesse. Uh, no. I don't think I did. I'm pretty sure Axel meant Magnus. Jesse, the point is, you should be going to Eligard's. It's the clear choice to make. You've got to come with me. You're my best friend, Jesse. It's you and me. Like always. Think about it, Jesse. This is more of a gut call. We need to make sure we get this right. We're not going to get a second shot at this. Whatever. Olivia? You and I are going to Eligard. Awesome. Axel, you stay here with Lucas and get the place ready for when Petra shows up. What, with that guy? I'm right here? Come on, Axel. For Petra's sake. Fine, I'll do it. For Petra. I'll take it. Uh, guys? Please hurry. Jesse and Olivia return to the Nether, intent on finding Eligard, the Redstone Engineer. And find themselves in a place of mechanical marvels, Redstone rarities. Amazing machines, limited only by the imagination of their brilliant creator. While the great storm grows, consuming everything in its wake, time is running out for our intrepid heroes.